What's up, y'all? Okay, y'all ready to finally see the bathroom? I'm finally done. I ain't 100% done, but I'm done enough for y'all to see it. Because there's still some things that be going on through my head that I might end up doing in there. And if I do end up doing some other things, I'll come back and show y'all. But anyways, y'all ready for the bathroom makeover that I've done? Okay, y'all. So, let's go. Y'all like my bunny? Let's go in now. Let's go see. Okay, so when you come around the corner, this is what you see. First thing you see are those towels. And... The toilet paper holder and the trash can look at what I did to the trash can these are the rugs that I got I'm not completely satisfied with them but that's what I got I got both of these rugs from uh, family dollar family dollar family dollar rugs okay now you got a toilet I got the toilet seat cover from Walmart. And the thing behind the toilet. Behind the toilet. Whatever you call that. Um, remember those rocks used to be in there? Now I just put some extra towels there. These are going to be towels that we don't use, you know. I don't know why black folk do that. Why we do that, y'all? We have towels in our bathroom that nobody better not touch. Okay, now you go up. And you got these same things that I had in here before. And I just put flowers up there. Now, y'all can't, the bling ain't paying off real good on camera, but they blingy. They bling blingy. I'll give y'all a close-up in a minute. So, they go to the shower curtain. See how tall it is? And those flowers that I did on the hooks. And the blingies that's coming off. The bling hanging diamonds. I put on every other one because I use some of them for another project. But I might end up, um... Let me back up. I might end up breaking that other project down and putting the bling on all of the hooks instead or either taking all of the hooks off. So this is the shower curtain that I got. It looks like that at the top. And all the way to the bottom, it looks like this. So if I could back up any more to show you the whole shower curtain, I could, but I can't. But that's what it looks like at the bottom half. I go to the top, it looks like that. I got the shower curtain off Amazon. I will leave a link in the description box. Um, if you feel like you want to purchase this. I think it was $14. I think. I forgot. But I'll leave a link below. So with those things that I put on the shower curtains. Those flowers. I just bought. I just brought. That flower down. And I use it on my bath and body works candles right here. That I blinged out. Okay now. If I was sitting on a toilet and you was looking at me, you were standing in front of me, this is what you'll see. The toilet, the back of the toilet, go up, you see the cabinet, bath and body works, shelves, go up, that's the whole cabinet, go up, 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 flowers, okay? Okay, you got it? Got it. Okay, so you got the mirror over there. Which need to be cleaned. And these are the things that's on my sink now. They were just some cups I got from the Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree cups. I blinged them out. I got five of them. They fit on the thing. I have to have one in the back, one in the front, one in the back, one in the front. Because they did not go evenly on it. And they were a little bit too big. So, here is the picture. Okay. So, here is that picture. Which I was seeing in the video. I can't get the bling action going, y'all. If y'all see this in person, y'all be like, dang, bling, bling. But it's really blingy. Okay, now, that's it. Then we got the door right there. Come back around. Got the bling there. The flowers. By the by the in this. Oh, let me show y'all these towels. These are the towels. Let's see if I can get them in there. Okay, this is the towels. Toilet paper holder. I redid the toilet paper holder while well, I spray painted it. And it still got the bling on it. And, I, you know, I did silver, you know. Trash can down there below. Okay, y'all, this is what the trash can looks like. Give y'all a close-up of the trash can. I just wrapped the bling around there and glued it on. Spray painted it with an old trash can. Uh, You know, I went back to buy another one. Because they ain't that cheap, you know. 
Well, it is kind of cheap, but why buy another one? Ain't nothing wrong with this one. There you go. Oh. I, I hot glued these things on there. Don't worry. Uh, these towels will not be used. They're not for consumption. <laughs> They're not for anybody to use them. But that's what the towels look like. I wish this bling would be paying off. And then I wrapped the piece. I didn't hot glue the middle towel. I just wrapped that bling around itself and I glued it to itself. I didn't put glue on that towel. Um, then as you go up, I have two candle jars on either side. These candle jars here and here come from the Dollar Tree. Candle jar in the middle came from Walmart a long time ago. I just reused it. This thing at the bottom of this candle jar right there, right there. That's a bouillon cube glass. Y'all know what bouillon cubes is? What you season your meat with? What you cook with? And all of that good stuff? That's what that is. It just blinged out. I have another one on this side too. And if you go up, you can see those flowers. They got all kind of blingy stuff going on in them. I'm going to see if I can take them down. And that's a Ciroc bottle that's blinged out. Right there. And I just use it as a vase. As a vase. And that's pretty much it, y'all. Right there. I'm going to see if I can show y'all. Hold on, let me give you a closer look of this bouillon cube thingy. I can't get it in the screen. In the, I can't get a good uh, focus on it because I got my other hand on the camera. So, But I see it. It's real blingy. And that's what that looks like. That's what that is. It's just turned upside down here. And I actually glued it onto the Bath and Body Works candle. There's a candle in here. Uh, and that's the bling. Let me see if I can bring this down a little bit to your level. To your level. To your level. I got all of these flowers from the Dollar Tree. You can only get silver flowers from the Dollar Tree this time of year that I have ever seen. And it got two different types of flowers. One a brighter red and one a darker red. Put that back up there. And I'm going to bring it back around to these flowers here. Hold on, let me see if I can get one down for you. Okay, so set that on the sink. So we got that kind of bling in the flower. You see that? These little bling balls right here. Got those from the Dollar Tree as well. All these little blingy bling blings. Y'all don't be talking about the bathroom because this is an old house built in 1902. So, I mean, it really wasn't 1902, but it was 19 something. But, and that's it, y'all. Let me give y'all an overview again. Back up. Okay. That's what the bathroom look like. All the way up. I got an 84 inch long shower curtain. So if you purchase this shower curtain, just remember this one is 84 inches because I wanted the height in the bathroom. This is a small bathroom. So in order for me to make it look a little bit bigger, I just went a little bit higher than the regular 76 inches, I believe. So that's what I did. And I moved the shower curtain up. As you can see, and you can see that spot right there on the wall. That's how high I lifted it up because when I lifted it, it took some paint off the wall. And I got to retouch that up. So that just, that's just to show you it's about a foot higher than the last shower curtain. About a whole foot almost. All right, that edit. But that's it, y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all think about, you know, my, did I, did I do too much? Did I not do enough? Do I need to bling this out? What I need to do besides clean the bathroom, you know, well, let me know. I know. And then I got this. Okay, y'all, so that is it, my bathroom reveal. I know y'all, like, about time. I need to clean this mirror. But anyways, y'all, that's all I got to say in this video. And I will holler at y'all later. Bye.